It feels like you should be listening to some 50s music while you do this brand new exercise, but we're starting to see it all over Portland. You see it in parks, you see it at farmers markets around town. Uh, hula hooping is back as a way of exercise, and we have uh, decided to embarrass Susanna and myself trying to do the hula hoop today. We brought in certified hoop instructor Paige Tashner. Hi, Paige. How are Hi, you? Hi. Nice to see you guys. So, um, really, where do we start? I remember trying it as a kid. I don't remember being good at it as a kid. Well, um, the kids' hoops now are too small for you, so we're, we've got a little advantage with the larger adult size hoop so it rotates slower and it's easier to hoop with so Do you, you already have, have any way big ones then that's pretty big okay all right, all right. so we can step it. into the hoop are you saying at the age we rotate slower <laughs> <laughs> you can well you're taller so it's uh, it's height proportionate for a beginner hoop so to begin with, what you're going to be doing is pushing with your belly and your back and using your lower legs. This pushing is with my start. belly shouldn't be a so problem, Paige. So watch out behind you. Oh, okay, gotcha. Always look behind you when you begin Are we going to collide into each other here? Oh, we'll find out as well. We'll make sure. Right. So just give it, a, give it a spin and just push into it. And you're hooping. So keep oh, pushing. Okay. Yes, yeah. nice, yeah. nice. Yeah. So, First one out. <laughs> so what the hoop is telling you is you're not hooping fast enough. Okay. So if you hoop a little faster. Hoop faster, Jake. Yes, All so right. it will stay up. So there you go. Keep. That one. Left, and the other key is right. keep your tailbone tucked under, stand up tall, and don't keep lean over. Keep your tailbone tucked under. Tucked under. Okay. As soon as you bend over and chase the hoop, the hoop falls faster. Okay, gotcha. One more time. So keep pushing. Look up. Uh -oh. Look up. Gotcha. There you go. There we go. All right. That's it. That's exactly really afraid, it. You know, that's it. I still got a bit of this gut left. I was a little afraid that was going to be a key just like that. that was you don't happen. have to have hips. You don't have to be thin. It's for all sizes and shapes. Okay. Um, but let's you're talking I'm, about losing weight. This let's is say that I'm not thin. And I need to, you know, start becoming more thin. This is, I mean, I'm already breathing. This is a hard. great way. It's a great cardio right off the bat. You're just having fun. Right. And you work up a sweat. Is this You're, just, so this is just purely a core workout. Can you get any other muscles into yes, the action Yes, you here? can take this on to your arms as well. Do different things to get... This is a little more of a complicated move, and we're not hitting any lights. Excellent. That does, that's so hard. you start to feel it through feel here, it and you arms. switch... Hands. That means my, my 11 year old Olivia will not be able to flippy flap there. Right. That, so that does work. That works a lot through here. All right. Um, also doing hand hooping like this. You're oh, definitely. Oh, that's wow. like parade move. Yeah. It definitely, <laughs> moves. definitely parade move. Awesome. So, so can you show us some of the advanced moves that can be done with the hula hoop? I this is a I can. Uh, can you show us Susanna this? like a month from now? <laughs> yes. So Susanna, we can have you up on your. Podium. <laughs> Getting some arm movements, and you're definitely, your heart rate's beginning to go up. Oh, oh that's. Start to. Oh. Angle hoop. Whoa. Ow. Whoa. Shaka Khan. Shaka Khan. <laughs> <laughs> so, this is just. You bent at the waist. That I learned in my first lesson as you about a minute ago that you're not supposed to do that. Well, there's also the angle hooping. So, as you get stronger. And, okay, the rule again, always look behind you. Yeah. So, we can also do a lot of lower body work by doing what's called a limbo or a, I think it's called sun, uh -huh. where you're leaning back. Ow! Yes. I'm not going to be able to pull off that move, I'll tell you right but now. But this really works your lower legs and your lower body. Oh, I what don't you're doing think is you're, that's working for you're me. You're meeting the hoop with your lower belly, uh -huh. pretending you've got two strings attached to your hip bones, uh -huh. and it's pulling you, and it's like you're doing the limbo, so you really get Oof. this lower body yeah. workout. <laughs> I could, I could see myself on that's playback on my TV yes, later. Yes, that's what yes, I. Yes, yes, yes. Ooh, is that? Oh my God! <laughs> nice. That's so so somebody. <laughs> say she doesn't. Say somebody doesn't have Savannah's natural talent. Uh, how do they get in touch with you to learn more about this? Um, I have a website. It's hulahoopla.com. Um, I do classes. Uh, Private lessons. I make hoops. I do parties. I've done bachelorette parties, oh. kids parties. Oh, fun! Um, I perform kids parties. So I particularly like this hoop because it completes my flag day outfit, yes, which I was does. really going oh, for does. earlier. So, Paige Tashner, a certified hoop instructor. Let's hula hoop out, shall we? Yes. Hoop it. All right, Jenny. Hoop dreams. What's coming up? Studio oh, six. Oh boy, Jake, you just really got shown.